Area DMG. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You guys, you guys look great. Let's go, guys. We are, we are the chaos. Let's do it.
true, we are. <sighs> you guys used to the Denver air yet? No. No? I, I swear I'm gonna add to my rider, I want like an oxygen tank backstage, so I can just... I'm good to go, alright! <laughs> so my name is Kieran Strange, um, you might have heard our single here last year, Dave and I were hanging out. I think we played our single Legacy a couple times. Um, we've come a long way since then, we've got Alex in the band, we have rotating drummers. Yeah. We're currently playing with Toph, who's amazing. Woo! This yeah. band, Bit Force, is touring with MC Chris, I believe, coming up soon. So, uh, and they have a show in Denver, right? When? 421. That's a great date. <laughs> if you're not too hungover on 421, go check these guys out. Or just start a new hangover, it's all good. Um, so, I wanted to uh, bring this next single out to you guys. Uh, we did this one a while ago, like I've been doing this song for a bit. Um, and then we just sort of made it into something else, so we, we really like playing this one. It's going to be our new single as well. Uh, we're going to head up to Chicago and record this. Um, but just to kind of put you guys in the mood, um, have you ever had like that best friend? Like especially at cons, because all the best friends I've had have been like in the nerd scene for this thing. Um, where like everyone, you're always going everywhere together, so everyone just assumes that you're dating. Yeah. I see that energy. <laughs> right? It's like, so, I wrote a song about it, because why the hell not? So, I hope you guys enjoy this, it's going to be single. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> I'm like, I'm just looking around at the customer. Not 
trace on us. All right. We're going to do another cover. We did this one in a couple of covers, and it seemed to go over really well, and we were really surprised at the amount of people who knew this. Um, so if you know the song, props to you, you know some random, obscure pop punk, and we're proud of you. Um, if you don't, enjoy it. It's a weird song. We like it. It's called The Tuning Song. It's called The Tuning Song. Um, Dave's really good at it. He practices it all the time. Is that the tuning song baby? Can you guys just hang out in the elevator and do that like all day? <laughs> Does anyone notice the elevators here make weird noises? Yeah, we actually determined it's a B natural. Thank you. I love living with the It's great fun. So if you sing a D sharp, it'll be harmonizing in thirds. You can harmonize with the weird noise the elevator makes. Alright, let's do this. Thank you. 
song is so bloody weird. Who knows it? Oh, it's a good tune. Yeah. Oh, oh man. That song. <sighs> <sighs> so I did want to mention that, like, um, I, I think I mentioned it in my interview this morning. Um, I like pretty much kind of came out as trans at this con. <laughs> I, I was doing my LGBTQ panel. We were chatting, and I, I kind of brought up the fact that I wanted to start going by E pronouns. And someone in the audience put their hand up and said, "Just do it." And I was like. Why did I think of that? <laughs> so, <laughs> one of the first songs I actually ever wrote was um, very much about the whole spirit of the, the cosplay and anime and con community. Just because I've, I've found my home here with you guys. I'm sure many of you guys are the same way. So yeah, we're all like, we're all family now. We're all like weird family that get together once a year for like a big party. And like, you know there's that one person in your group who's like the drunk uncle that gets into trouble? You know, you're all thinking of someone. <laughs> <laughs> yes, in, in my group, I mean, you, you're teetotal, you're, you're a good boy. Thank you. Um, so when I wrote this song, I really wanted it to be just dedicated to like the con community and the anime community and the geek community and all us weirdos out there. Um, this is one of the uh, songs off my first album. So this song is called Adamantine Hearts. And um, I'm pretty sure some of you who know me have probably heard it. So the people. <laughs>
Um, which is super fun because it's really introduced me to a whole bunch of music I never knew before. But it's also a real pain in the ass because now I can no longer say I'm not a fan of the Beatles. <laughs> I can no longer be that hipster and that makes me really angry. Do you know how annoying it is being a British musician? And now I do like the Sodding Beatles. So, um... You said the Soggy Beatles? Sodding. Oh, so I'm like, were they submerged? They, they were, in their yellow submarine. <laughs> so, uh, I really wanted to do a Beatles guy, because I thought like it was apt, because I'm British, and he's super into Beatles. Um, so I picked my favorite Beatles song, uh, which I actually heard in a comedy when I was like a kid, before I even knew who the Beatles really were. Because my mum showed it to me, and that's my mum, and she's here. Woo! Thanks so much, guys. Have a good night. All right, so we're gonna do some. We're gonna, we're gonna jam up for you guys. We hope you appreciate it. Mostly we just do it because it's fun, so we hope you entertain you guys as well. <laughs> Oh, 
on like January 19th last year, we released a song. Um, you know, because things were happening politically and we wanted to sort of let people know that we sort of supported them, whatever they were up to. So I was at Dave's house at the time. I think we were like writing or recording or doing something crazy. And we just wrote a song like in like an hour and we decided we liked it. So now we're working on it. It should be on uh, our upcoming album, which we're going to be recording this year. So we're pretty stoked about it. It's a full concept album. We want to take you into a weird, scary place. I'm pretty stoked. Get some creativity going. Oh, we'll cool. give you a musical hug with this song. We'll give you a musical hug with this, this song. We're, we're hugging. It's consensual. It's like a consensual. Only if you want the hug. It's a yeah, consensual. Yeah, consensual aud auditorial musical hug. Should we get it? We hope you guys like it. I can do that.
let's not pay attention to me cutting a song that Colorado means I can't sing. <laughs> How do you live up here? How do you do anything? <laughs> I, had a, I had a friend, I think it might have been you guys actually, somebody told me they came to Denver, uh, they came to Seattle to, for a conventional appointment, and they ran for a red light, went for a green light, and they got to the light, they went, I'm not out of breath, I don't know what to do. It's like, yes, feel our oxygen, it's amazing. All oh, right, rock and roll. So, Dave and I heard this song at San Japan, I think. And I hadn't seen the anime at the time, um, even though so many people have been telling me to watch it. Um, and it's a freaking good anime. Um, but at the time, like, we just we heard the song and we were like, this is the most inspirational effing song I've ever heard in my life. And it was being sung by, what's his name, Nick Wilde from Zootopia, which was just a mind warp. But it was really cool, and we listened and we were like, we have to cover this song, it's so good. But um, then I watched the anime and I was like, I have to cover this song. So, let's rock Shout out to Zach. Shout out to Zach. <laughs> that was his name, yes, Zach. That was the guy, he was so cool. Do you need a mic for this? No. No, I'm just going to write. I need you to have a mic. Okay, cool. Well, let's push it this way then, so you don't look super awkward. Like, it's not like in front of your face. Oh. <laughs> Musicians, who's the singer? They're really hard. <laughs>
they're all going, well actually, <laughs> I had a really shitty morning. <laughs> Alright, thank you guys so much. Um, my merch didn't arrive because USPS are as bad as Canada Post apparently. I'm sorry. But UPS suck even more, so... Um, so what we're actually doing is, Kit, if you give us a wave... Hey, there's Kit. If you have money on each side and you do want to buy something, I have CDs for five bucks. Uh, and pins for five bucks too, and that comes with a download card of the next song, the pins do. Uh, actually, what, what the hell, CDs as well, we'll, we'll give away a download card. And if you buy, you get a download card for this next song. Um, my merch will be here tomorrow, so um, you can either grab something now, we'll give you a voucher and you'll definitely get something, or um, you can drop by the community tables tomorrow, I'll be tweeting out where we are, and when we are, and uh, we'll have merch and stuff on us. Also, I'm doing a book publishing panel tomorrow, at 2.30 to 4, I believe, in Power Room 1. Um, it's just about how to self-publish. I, I wrote a male-male romance novel recently uh, called Black Ties, so I'll be there and my roommate will be there. She's awesome and she's written a bunch of books, so we'll have our merch there too. But you should come to the panel anyway, especially if you like ever looked at publishing something or know someone who wants to publish something. It's good. I've talked too much. I like to sell my own voice. Tomorrow night, but it's 21 plus, I think. So, yeah, sorry. We got, we got caught into doing it, but I'm also doing it. We'll be at closing ceremonies and we'll be hanging out all weekend. And I think we're going to head out to the rave tomorrow night. So, we'll be around and we'll see you guys and we'll be rocking with you guys. It'll be fun. I do want to say a huge thank you to Sean and the rest of the uh, Mega Man Sound crew. And, uh, also, tonight, the entire guest relations staff, uh, especially Lindsay, who's head of guest relations, she takes care of us. She like herds us around a little sheep. It's really great. I like to all of our handlers as well who put up with us and feed us. My handlers are amazing. They're constantly pushing water into my hands. Kyle I had as a hand two years ago. Woo! He saw me backstage and had a Red Bull in his hand. And I was like, you remembered! These guys are amazing. They put on such a good con. And Joey has been live streaming this whole thing. So thanks, Joey. Facebook or YouTube? YouTube. Because screw Facebook! It's about a Marvel movie that came out a little while ago, and if you can guess what it is, you win nothing, but you win my love and affection. Um, so we've been... Nothing? <laughs> that is not nothing, that is a big thing. Uh, I'm Kieran Strange, we are, we are the chaos. You can find us online at Kieran Strange, at Super Dave. Find us online, like, through me, because their animals are all weird. Um, you can also find us at hashtag we are the chaos. We'll see you guys all weekend and we'll be around. And then come say hi to us in the back even if you don't want to get anything. I might take selfies and chill with us. It's starting soon, but we love you guys.
the 21st century folk. <laughs> Here we go, hey! Where's the band up? Alright, everyone about to take a selfie! Come get him! Let's do it!